Welcome to the KPMG Connected, Powered, and Trusted series for Knowledge 21. Hear how KPMG and ServiceNow are embedding a balanced approach to risk into your transformation cycle, securing stakeholder confidence and regulatory compliance that enable responsible growth, bold innovation, and high performance. Join KPMG leaders Diana Keel and Farah Ramtula as we explore how KPMG and ServiceNow are helping organizations build resilience and establish stakeholder trust through the KPMG Integrated Risk Management Solution. Hello and welcome to Knowledge 2021 Digital. I'm Farah Ramtula and I'm joined by one of my colleagues, Diana Keel, and we're here to talk to you about integrated risk management and how this framework can help organizations build stakeholder trust. We'll cover why trust is so important now more than ever and share our viewpoints on what integrated risk truly is and how ServiceNow can help. Diana, welcome, great to have you. Thank you, it's a pleasure to be with you today. So um, Diana, you know, I think we've all seen over this last year that there's been rapid change. Organizations are, have had to react um, to the pandemic and other events and digitizing has become at the forefront of every business. How are leaders thinking about integrated risk management or GRC today, and why is it so important now? I think, you know, our landscape is ever-changing, and we've seen that firsthand, and having to be um, adaptive to it. And I think as, you know, we look at across and working with our different stakeholders and CEOs and um, the C-suite leaders within these business units of integrated risk management, and really collectively, um, you know, they are pressured to be more proactive and data driven um, and, and bringing solutions to the table. And through that and that risk management process, you know, the digital effort of that has become, you know, the forefront of their um, minds. Great. So, you know, risks are emerging. The landscape is constantly, it's, it's always changed, right? right? And it's changed even more so. There's a lot of things that people have implemented. So, so tell me, how does that tie into integrated risk management and what's KPMG's view? So when we kind of really look at how do you do that, you know, alignment of your cross-functional business units as part of that integrated risk management approach, we typically see, you know, your compliance teams, your operational resiliency teams, third-party risk, um, alignment on your control frameworks in order to support the management of that risk is really aligning on those processes. And, and how you're viewing them and the data that supports that. So that when you're rolling up and drilling down, it's concise. So thanks for sharing that, Diana. Um, you know, when I hear you speak about all of the different business units and alignment, it really reminds me of um, somewhat of a team sport and how integrated risk across the enterprise involves all these different parties and bringing together all this data. And I think that's one of the biggest advantages of the ServiceNow platform. So with that, how does the ServiceNow platform really help and tie to building stakeholder trust? Yeah, that's right. I think the, the digital aspect of that is huge and utilizing um, platforms such as ServiceNow, I mean, it brings so many benefits. And I think, you know, with the utilization for a lot of organizations, they already have it as an enterprise tool in other functions. And right away, we're seeing that from a cost reduction perspective, ability to tap into that. And really also you're benefiting from, you know, the cross-reference of shared data and leveraging that, especially around some of that supporting aspects within um, your controls and the core processes that you're centralized around as a business. Um, and being able to share and leverage that and really speak one methodology and one terminology of that data a lot of leaders struggle with is really the reporting and the ability to quickly aggregate and do that. Um, and that's a real large strength of ServiceNow is having all of your data centralized alleviates that and building those relationships off of that, of what you're already utilizing from the platform perspective. So given that, you know, you have all these great benefits of the platform and have the ability to unify multiple groups um, who may already even be on the platform. And, and given that we're approaching integrated risk management as a team sport in some ways, where are organizations today, Diana? Can you speak to maybe, are you seeing that more of them are coming together? Are their risk functions still siloed? And how have you helped bring them together and establish that culture or that trust culture? 
So I think it's a little bit of both. We see people, um, you know, in, in a varying kind of aspect, but a lot of them are all wanting to do better, right? And become more integrated. And, you know, for your respective organization, it might be a little bit, a little bit of both. Um, and sometimes, you know, we've seen it's, it, there is already alignment maybe with spin core groups, you know, within our SOX and audit, we see a lot more working together. Um, but as you kind of start to open those floodgates of more um, business functions, really trying to drive alignment to manage that, um, you know, one of our recent um, clients, we had the very similar like problem that you just stated, Farah, of like siloed, um, working together well in certain areas, um, but really moving towards fully integrated and, and the leveraging of one platform and, and sharing of information. And, and that kind of took a series of effects, right? And, and there was, you know, from our perspective, the actions that were taken was really bringing all of your leaders together, alignment on what are your core processes and workflows and breaking that down and, and then kind of leveraging and opening the door to share each other's information, which then increased, frankly, what you mentioned, your trust within each other, right? And the data that you're sharing and the credibility that it now has versus, you know, prior where there was silo tools and, and kind of passing up data that opened the door for questioning. So, so you've taken us through kind of the strategy side, how to bring people together and agree and align on the strategy and vision for an integrated risk management function. You've certainly taken us through why it's important and, and why it's important now more than ever, given the rapidly changing risk profiles and, and dynamics. Could you maybe talk a little bit about the benefits you've seen across our clients? What have they seen? How has their experience changed? What are maybe some of the key metrics and really the return on value? Yeah, I think the, the largest really is um, the ease of use of their process and their job. They're not having to jump into so many tools as before. Um, you know, when your controls are fragmented across multiple tools, it's cumbersome, right? And there's a training and learning curve to that. So you really start to limit that. You start to tailor your focus organizationally from an end user's perspective that really creates their world, you know, makes their world a lot better. An additional benefit I think that we're seeing as well is really, um, you know, what, what is it driving for the business of reducing your cycle time and for example, internal audit and being able to, you know, have one control, test it once, use many, and you're able to kind of minimize that workload for your end users as well. And, and I think that's a, that's a huge, a huge one. Okay. Awesome. So, so really what you're, you're enabling your users to do is shift their focus from being more reactive to being more proactive, proactively managing their risk organization by opening up that time and, and reducing mm -hmm. that cycle time. So, so that's great. Thank you so much, Diana, for sharing your valuable experience with us. You know, I think what we can all take away is that in this environment, I, it's, it's really clear that establishing trust is more important now than ever and leveraging an integrated risk management framework and treating this as a team sport across your enterprise is a key success factor for most organizations. We also learned that you know, it's about bringing everybody to the table. It's about creating that culture of trust and approaching this in, in more than just a technical way, but in bringing people around a shared vision and a shared strategy. Um, we also learned that we have great uh, capabilities and accelerators in play that you all can leverage uh, working with us. And I'm sure that you're happy to connect with any one of our viewers. So with that, I'd like to, to thank you once again, and I hope that you're all enjoying your Knowledge 2021 digital experience. Thank you for joining us. We look forward to bringing you additional insights as we continue the ServiceNow Knowledge 21 digital experience. In the meantime, learn more by visiting us at visit.kpmg.us forward slash knowledge.